Vachanamrit and the Holy Quran. Common Points of Agreement Hello and welcome to our video where we explore the common points of agreement between two great scriptures the Vachanamrit and the Holy Quran. Both these scriptures have a profound impact on the lives of millions of people around the world. In this video, we will examine the similarities between these two great texts and how they both teach us to lead a righteous and fulfilling life. Point 1. Monotheism The first point of agreement between the Vachanamrit and the Holy Quran is the belief in monotheism. Both scriptures assert that there is only one God, who is the ultimate creator and sustainer of the universe. The Vachanamrit states that the Supreme Being is one without a second while the Holy Quran declares, say, He is Allah, the one and only. Point 2. Importance of Prayer The second point of agreement is the emphasis on prayer. Both the Vachanamrit and the Holy Quran advocate for the importance of prayer as a means to connect with the Divine. The Vachanamrit teaches that prayer is the means to purify the heart while the Holy Quran states, and establish regular prayer, for prayer restrains from shameful and unjust deeds. Point 3. Compassion and Charity The third point of agreement is the importance of compassion and charity. Both the Vachanamrit and the Holy Quran teach that one should be kind and charitable towards others. The Vachanamrit emphasizes that a true devotee of God is one who has love for all while the Holy Quran says, and spend in charity out of the sustenance which we have bestowed on you before that time when death will come to someone, and he shall say, O oh my Lord, if only you would grant me reprieve for a little while, then I would give in charity, and be among the righteous. Point 4. Forgiveness The fourth point of agreement is the importance of forgiveness. Both the Vachanamrit and the Holy Quran teach that forgiveness is a virtue that one should strive to cultivate. The Vachanamra teaches that one who forgives others will himself be forgiven. While the Holy Quran declares, And let not those among you who are blessed with graces and wealth swear not to give any sort of help to their kinsmen, and massacre the poor, and those who left their homes for less cause, let them pardon and forgive. Do you not love that Allah should forgive you? And Allah is oft forgiving, most merciful. In conclusion, we have examined the common points of agreement between the Vachanamrit and the Holy Quran. Both these great scriptures teach us to lead a righteous and fulfilling life by emphasizing the importance of monotheism, prayer, compassion, charity, and forgiveness. By understanding and practicing the teachings of these texts, we can strive towards a life of virtue and righteousness. Thank you for watching this video and we hope you found it informative and insightful.